okay so whatever the land is of the river that is up to this much we are supposed to leave but what we have done we have restricted it within this and that's the reason the situation is becoming grave and what i said about in most of the countries like across the globe it will not be an exaggeration if i say that 75% of the rivers are almost dry because when i say live river means i have shown you what is required when i call it as a live river means be free flowing when this river has this kind of zones then it will be automatically self flow but today what is happening either the storm water is really thank you so much for this introduction and thank you all of you for coming here and dr sneha gode and actually the full bright college here invited by our college that is a uh, this is cuny at the same time i'm thankful to dr dot j and many others those who have you know understood the importance of what uh, what i bring from india to uh, integrate all of us together so that we can do some work for a common goal because today it is all about that all the rivers are getting dry most of the places are facing with the water scarcity like uh, two days back news is that even ground water of new york and most of the us places becoming very much salty because there is a lot of study which has been conducted with the wells and they are giving all salty water that means and the reason behind it is given about the road salts which is being used to you know keep the uh, snow not getting into hard packs and similarly if you ask about india india has lot of issues of depletion of groundwater why the depletion what is happening let us see because as i will be taking you through my journey of the work that i will be able to show you what exactly i'm trying to say and this session today's orientation is more about how we all can go to the field and have an understanding about why we should know the rivers what is the actual status of the river what needs to be actually there what is getting encroached why things are getting worse so that is what we need to understand and so i thought that first let it begin with the orientation then we will be going to the field visit where with our own eyes when we see we connect we get sensitized because it's really a very serious issue although we see so lot of water a planet is with lot of water but still we are today talking about the scarcity of water so we have to understand why this situation and why we have to go to the river and basically the field visit is more about you know in india we try to run a kind of a sessions on the river which we call it as nadi patshala that means river school and the main motive or the theme behind it is let's know our rivers because most of us don't know what is it actually a river the river which we are seeing like just in our vicinity is the halam river flowing so whether we can call it as a free flowing river or whether it is an atmospheric river because today's trend is more like about the atmospheric flow of the river atmospheric river means because of the climate change the way we see that one day only a funnel light and then a lot of pouring of water at one place and suddenly a river gets created so that's what is a
bridge is Brooklyn? Brooklyn. This is which place? This ferry for of a uh, choppers going? 